jury duty. That's why there was no episode last week. Now that I'm back, let's get started with our Christmas episode. As I was counting the ceiling tiles in the jury assembly room, I decided what should I make for my Christmas episode? As I was thinking, a man with ginger hair sat up next to me, ate his sandwich, and left behind bread crumbs. And then it hit me. Eggnog pudding. Let's get started. First things first, the dry ingredients. Now, get a medium sized bowl and add three tablespoons of cornstarch. Three quarters of a cup of sugar, a pinch or half a teaspoon of salt. Mix it all together with a whisk. Next, add six egg yolks. Oh, almost forgot something. One teaspoon of freshly grated nutmeg. Now, can you use pre-ground nutmeg? Sure. Also, while you're at it, why don't you give Jesus a nice big kick to the cross while you're at it? Uh, sorry, sorry. It's just that if you use freshly grated nutmeg in your eggnog pudding, it's going to taste way better. Use freshly grated nutmeg. That's the only Christmas gift I ask from you. Take a whole nutmeg berry and just uh, grate it enough until you get like about a teaspoon's worth. Finally, while whisking, drizzle in two cups of milk. We're going to cook the custard in a double boiler. So, in a four quart sauce pot, fill it up with an inch of water. Once it reaches the boil, reduce the heat down to a simmer. Place our pudding mix on top. Stir until it begins to thicken. All right, the moment it begins to thicken up, take it off the heat. Now then, while it's still hot, let's add in half a stick of butter chopped up into six cubes. Don't add the next cube until this cube is fully melted and so forth. Adding the butter will give it a nice smooth creamy texture. Finally, half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Take some saran wrap, put it on the surface of the pudding, stash it away in the fridge, and let it cool down for about a couple hours. Top it off with a little bit of cinnamon. Boom, ready to eat. You know what? Santa can keep his cookies. I'll have a nice bowl of eggnog pudding instead. And hey, give me some credit. I made it through this entire video without making a single Bill Cosby reference. Oops. This has been Chase Cutting Kitchen. I'm CRJ, making cooking fun and meaning it this time. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, smack that like button. If you enjoy my work, consider subscribing. And uh, that right there, that's my most recent video. Go check it out. I'll see you next week with a new video. Toodle-oo.